hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to another flip through so we are flipping through november today let's see yeah so sorry i've got all these like i'm still like trying to set up my my week and december and like i haven't even started thinking about next year but i do have my um stylogy in a or a style cover this is the red one um just because it's like christmasy time and i love it um so yeah just my monthly sort of overview calendar gratitude uh, you can see i'm not like too fussy about what pen I use um, but I think this was all like the time that I was away I was on Iceland um, so yeah I actually did want to mark my I'm gonna do that now with the blue marker pen just because I like to kind of see my travel oops this is gonna be very messy in one sort of just like quick glance so I think what I did is I ac accidentally did that here Oh, maybe not. Anyway, I thought I accidentally had done that um, on this calendar. But anyway, this is my monthly memories. Love how that turned out. Kids' memories. I actually need to take these out now. And then homeschool section. Not a bad month at all. <laughs> we did like 20 days of homeschool. Um, although I did not manage to keep on top of it in terms of like trackers. I think I should probably take these out and reuse them. Um, partly because the kids were just cracking on with stuff and yeah I, I think I haven't even put in a tracker this month because um, yeah whatever then this acetate with bats I just made myself I love the sort of gold shutter foil on there and then yeah I think the only stickers I actually used um, were like a lot of fox stickers I think I didn't go too crazy on washi tapes first week because I was a little bit running behind you can see it's mostly I think these I even put in afterwards maybe I was sort of uh yeah running behind in setting up my week so I was kind of like just doing it day by day like just sitting down Wednesday morning and like writing out um stuff but I did manage to keep on top of memory keeping which is always a nice thing to look back on um so yeah, but definitely like all this stuff I added in later, I think. Basic pages. I mean, I could go back and add washi to it, but I don't generally do that. Um, yeah, just because it, I kind of love like just paper and pen. And also it gives me like a good indication of what my um, days were like. Obviously very hectic. I think I've clipped some journaling here together. Um then I was making like a packing list for Iceland. This vellum and acetate are both um, from Lauren Phelps Designs. Again, no washi or many stickers even. And that's fine. And then we were in Iceland. So this was all, all like memory keeping. I did take my like create with pen stickers with me so I could do this there and then. So I would do it like in the, um, in the hotel at night. Just because I knew that I wouldn't remember, you know, what we did on each day if I left it till we got back. Um, so yeah, love, love, love these stickers so much. Um, I actually have like a huge stash of her Christmas stickers as well. But um, anyway, these are all the wintry ones, which I just adore. Love them. So that was really fun. My sisters um, took me to Iceland for my 40th birthday, which was in October. Um, yeah, beautiful. Just put in my little postcard that I like to do from everywhere, all our travels. I thought September, is September in here? So I thought I had put a Portugal one in here. But I think I might have just tucked it in at the back. So I need to remember to clip that in before I put this stylogy on the bookshelf. Um, but yeah, that was the last day. We got home and came back to lots of like uh, rain. I mean, it was very cold in Iceland, but not as cold as I expected. And I think because we had been like quite prepared with like thermal stuff, 
we actually didn't feel the cold as much but coming back home was definitely like so much warmer it was like double digits still um celsius wise it was like 12 13 14 even um very very unusual for sort of mid-november but yeah very nice blue blue pen which is quite unusual for me but all these washi tapes are all from london gifties love these little stickers from salam creative again all these shops are tagged in the description box below um yeah not really kind of doing much in terms of decorating just yeah lists and memory keeping to be honest no i wasn't doing like timed dailies either and then this just happened today <laughs> i was like trying to catch up on my hobonichi cousin with my watercolors and somehow it just kind of seeped through but no problem luckily it matches <laughs> the washi that's on this page as well um this foiled vellum is from Brooke Ava Prints. I've sort of just stuck it to the back of that page there. Um, and then here again, these two pages here, I did some journaling. I, yeah, just something very, very private that I definitely didn't want to, like, for anybody to ever crumb, come across. Um, and I think also for myself, sometimes it's just nice to get things down and then let it go. So I just put acrylic paints over it. Um and the reason I do it like back to front is so that um the back is also covered in paint because if I, I I could have done like my two pages of journaling like this but then I'm always paranoid that someone will be able to read my writing on the other side um so yeah I just wrote on this side and painted it and then did some more writing and painted it and then I just had some vinyls that I thought I'm gonna add because I just yeah it's kind of like relevant to the journaling anyway so that's a beautiful um thing i do I, I do get asked where i get this faith over fear vinyl from quite a lot because i do use it quite a lot and um, so it's actually just a cut file from silhouette that i downloaded and i just cut it myself in different colored um foils this is just like hollow foil not foil vinyl um just gorgeous love it and then this is just like another silhouette file that i added um i actually like this page much better because it's got like some texture on it and then i had some happy mail from london gifties so i was swatching them love this like gold foil washi tape with like the coffee and tea mugs love these like moodies oh these florals can't wait to use these in spring actually more like cozy photography type washi tapes love these foxes i actually wish i like i had got this a bit earlier because i think this would have been like all over my october planner and um hobonichi cousin as well but anyway i have it for next year i love that one in particular the colors and just like sitting with a cup of tea looking out so nice uh and then following week just a little bit more of my usual layout in terms of like timed daily to do's and then yeah not much memory keeping so <laughs> still like not tons of stickers um i definitely go through phases where i'm like using way more stickers but um yeah i think sometimes i just throw one in just to kind of try and use up what i have i think i've used up my very last this too shall pass sticker from mandy plans mandy plans is it yes um so that's a shame but i think that's hand lettered by someone but i'm gonna try and just make my own ones with some different fonts because i do like those um love these then i just had like a page like i actually thought i was going to do something else here but then i ended up just putting some sticky notes this is really old vellum from happy scrappy like a really really old kit from quite a few years ago actually um but yeah just sort of last week um i know a lot of people had already 
set up December for this week, but I decided I was going to do, um, even though there are more days of December in this week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I just was not ready to set up December. So I just went ahead and kept this week in November, which is fine. I love these little sticky notes. Not sure where they're from. I've had them for a long time, but I'm just covering up some private stuff there. Um, I love this moon phase washi from London Gifties and I think I used it here as well yeah there's two different types there's like this brown one and then this grayish one and then yeah I think that nope a few more pages that's it just some more like sticky notes and then actually I realized I should have set up December and then swatched these. But anyway, I received some happy mail from Create With Pen. Um, I mean, I guess I received it in November. But um, yeah, she sent me some of her Christmas washi tapes as well as some notebooks. Um, so I just swatched those. I just, I adore her lettering so much. But yeah, that is it, guys. That's November all done. Um, now just to catch up on my Hobonichi cousin because <laughs> I'm quite a bit behind. I have spent the last few days that my kids have been sick um, doing a lot of like watercoloring and stuff. Um, this is till October. So yeah, I, I created like these pages here just with like watercolors, washi stickers and then kind of have gone through like I'm going through like um, a few weeks one or two weeks at a time just looking through my stylogy and seeing like is there anything that for that day that I want to journal about um and if so like do it and then I've got a picture here I want to put um for example this day I looked in my stylogy and there's nothing else I want to add to it so I'm going to just leave that blank for now because I have like always have like um scripture verses or book notes or quotes or you know other stuff that I want to fill these pages up with so that's how I do it I kind of will go through when I'm catching up I will go through page by page and on a day where I want to journal I will just get it done there and then here as well then these days I don't have anything to do so I've just like allowed myself to sort of be creative and do what I want with it and I will come back and put something on these pages I might add more stickers more washi um, but yeah there is no journaling that needs to happen for these days again same and then these are all my Iceland pages which I have just plopped some blue watercolor on it uh, they're actually going to be filled with like pictures so um, today we came back again I might put something here I might not might just leave it um, this one I just did now, these two. So I'm on this page now and yeah. So I will just keep um, going and leaving enough space for journaling if I want and then journal straight away. And then at the end of like, once I've gone through the whole of November, I'll be left with like lots of blank pages that I can go back and fill in with all my screenshot quotes and notes and things like that so I'm just sharing that because I do get asked like how you know I do my home in each cousin and whether I pre like sort of plan or pre prep my pages but I'm usually just always so behind <laughs> that yes I guess in this sense it is pre prepped um but I already know there's nothing for that day that needs to go there so I can I'm free to fill it up as I like um I will show you where we are in December so this was yesterday I just sat down and did it but um yeah the only thing I have put in for and like for the next few days is my um London Gifties washi tape for like the advent calendar she sent me like the two bags so I've got like two washies per day and that's all I've done for this week but yeah the rest of it nothing um and yeah that is my hobonichi cousin and then my hobonichi week so i'll quickly show you guys as well i think i haven't flipped through this in a while um i think i'll probably just do from like october onwards um 
so yeah definitely using the appointment side a lot more than the to-dos because I don't know I find like I'm turning to my astrology for this a, a lot more um unless like you know I'm away or I'm out and about and then I tend to use this a bit more um I do get asked about like pens I generally don't color coordinate I will pick up whichever pen is closest to me um if it's something that requires like you know attention <laughs> then I do try and do it a different color um um but yeah like I might I know that on Tuesdays I've got to be at the temple at 3 30 every day so I will just go with like one pen and put that in every single week so that will be obviously color coordinated but any other appointments or things that come up oops, let's get rid of that hair um yeah I just pick up whichever pen I I try not to just do the whole thing in black because it kind of just merges into one so I do like to use different colors for things to stand out a bit more um yeah and generally I'll put like a little sticker on each page that was when I was away but you'll see like the side of the page being used sort of less and less really and I don't mind like crossing things off if things get cancelled um yeah it's not <laughs> it's not it's not um a neat planner all these things get plugged into my astrology and my timed dailies so um yeah and this is this week okay so that is everything guys um i hope that was fun i better remember to put the portugal postcard in now but thanks so much for watching and i will see you next time take care bye